All right, real quick, I just want to go through, remind you guys what function notation is so that you can always remember how to determine if a, a line or a set of points is a function or not. First of all, we have a set of our x and the y um, coordinates, and they're labeled in this table. First thing, remember, our domain is always our set of our x, um, x coordinates. So therefore, our domain is going to be obtained negative 2, 2, 3, and 4. The domain, remember, is always the x coordinates. Our range is going to be our set of our y coordinates. Rewriting domain again. Range. That's going to be our 2, 4, 8, and 4. Which we don't need to replace right again because it's already in there. So we'll just have 2, 4, 8. Um, now we need to go and determine is it a function? And for you guys to remember if a function, it's always a function if you have one of your, every element in your domain go ahead and maps to exactly one element in your range. So negative 2 goes to 2. 2 goes to 4, 3 goes to 8, and 4 is 4. So therefore, each element in our domain maps to exactly one element into the range. So therefore, this is a function. An example, if I added a point, if I added any one of these um, domain values, and let's say map it to a different number, now this would not be a function. All right, so you can see this right here. Now this is not going to be a function. So, when you have uh, when you have this, you just need to make sure they map um, everything in domain maps to everything in the range. Then the next set is now when you look at it, is it going to be onto or one to one? First thing, onto. What that means is everything in the range has a map to the domain. So we look at there, and when you have coordinate points, it's pretty easy to see if it's um, onto or not. And we notice that every element in our range maps to something in the domain. So therefore, it is onto. Our one-to-one, -one, we look at this. Everything in the one-to-one -one means everything in the domain has to uniquely go to something in the range. And what we'll notice is we both have a 4 here. We say 2 goes to 4 and 4 goes to 4. So therefore, 4 in our range is not uniquely mapped. So therefore, this is not one-to-one. -one. And that's how you determine if a set of points is a function and what type of relation it is.